Okay, in this program, um, we're going to um, have the stepper motor stepping 12 steps and then back to the origin, waiting for 3 seconds, and then 24 steps back to the origin and stopping for 3 seconds, and then 48 steps back to the origin, stopping for 3 seconds, and then another 48 steps and back to the origin. So we have a stepper motor right here and the optocoupler which will set the reference position. Um, we have the Arduino Uno, the potentiometer right here, and the LCD display which will display the speed of the stepper motor and in RPM and the step number. So in, in our case it will be um, starting with 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, and then back 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, and so on. So here we're going to run the program, um, which at first, since this is kind of set at any sort of random position, the program is set to actually um, set the reference point. So you'll see that the stepper motor will actually go back to the reference point here. Um, and on the screen it'll actually say that it is um, it is uh, setting the reference point and initializing the program. So here we're going to plug it in. Begin program. And the stepper motor is a little out of whack the arrow. It's not perfect, but it's going through the program. Here we have it at a really, really fast spe um, speed, which is around 60 or 70 RPMs. And again, the RPMs are not exactly accurate. We try to do a little calculation to kind of approx approximate it, but it's not perfect. And due to delays in the program, um, the screen is actually not exactly in sync with the steps, but it, it does give an, an almost accurate present, representation of the number of steps and where the motor is located and things like that. So we're going to set it back to a lower RPM of around, according to our screen, it should be around um, 4 or 3. You can see the stepper motor is going really, really slow. So here it's going to go it's kind of starting in the middle of the program. It's going 48 steps and then back to the origin. I think this is going to be at the very beginning of the routine. So here you'll see it's going to go 12 steps back to the origin, waiting for 3 seconds. 1, 2, 3, 24 steps and then back to the origin. I'm waiting for three seconds and then 48 steps uh, back to the origin waiting for three seconds and lastly another 48 steps and on the screen you'll actually see it counting the number of steps here it's going back to the origin where it will start from the very very beginning and we can speed it up here 12 steps origin 24 origin 48 origin so you get the point and at any point any time you can actually um, reset the program where it will actually find the reference position and start to or begin the initialization process. So here we're going to reset it and you can see it's at the reference point. Right, to give you a better idea we can slow it down to around 1 RPM and reset it. And here you can see it's setting the motor reference point. 
where it's actually going clockwise until it finds um, the optocoupler. Bam! And then it'll start going, it's 12 steps, and you get the drift. <laughs> Thanks for watching!